Here, see if this is dry enough for you. What are you drinking? Same thing, straight. I was never one for girly drinks. Bond, are you there? Yes, Em. Right here. Nicole, do you mind if 007 and I speak privately for a moment? This is a need to know. Of course. No problem. We can talk. What did you find out? We've translated all the documents you photographed in Pomarov's office this afternoon. It appears that most of them were invoices for highly sophisticated chemical manufacturing equipment. They were to be delivered to a defunct chemical refinery he's recently brought back online in Siberia. Makes perfect sense. They tortured Tedworth, the researcher, for the code to his bio-research formulas. He was working on anthrax and smallpox antidotes for troops in the field, but they could just as easily be weaponized. That's what we're afraid of. No. That's what the whole world is afraid of. You've got to get there. Confirm what we think he's up to and stop him. Perhaps Miss Hunter can help you facilitate this. Yes, I'll talk to her. Good. Good luck, 007. You finished? I have to take a look at Pomerov's refinery in Siberia. Em thought you might be able to help facilitate things. I'm gonna need a flight, ground transportation, a local contact. And... Wait, wait, not so fast. I told Pomerov I'd get back to him about his business proposal. So it's the perfect cover to get the two of us into the refinery. The two of us? M said facilitate, not the company. Well, how do you think I'm going to get you to Siberia? Oh, let me guess. A friend of yours owns a plane? May I speak with Rudolph, please? Why am I not surprised? <laughs> You're going to love it. It's got a shower, a wine cellar, and the most unbelievable circular bed. Yes, I'll hold. What? What's that look for? You'll be enjoying all that stuff alone. I'll be in the cockpit flying the plane. Kind of your friend Rudolph to lend us his car. You sure he won't mind? He's got six of them. He won't miss it. What else are you going to spend your money on up here, aside from diamonds and wristwatches? Are you sure you want to go through with this? I just can't believe Pomerov would be involved with something evil. He's always been like an uncle to me. The entrance to the refinery is up ahead. Just do as I told you, follow the plan, and we'll be all right. This isn't all fun and games. You really think they're going to believe that you're my bodyguard? I think they'd be more suspicious if you didn't have a bodyguard. Yeah, it's Russia. You're nobody without one. Good. Put on your best attitude and sell it. Остановите! I'm here to see Stefan Pomrov. Is he expecting you? Do you think I just dropped into Siberia? I also need somewhere for my bodyguard to wait, where he can be fed and watered. Park the car over there, and he can wait in the shed. Спасибо. All right, I'm going to give you five minutes to get into Pomerov's office before I start causing trouble. I can live with that. That's the idea. Yes? Sorry to interrupt, 007. We hacked into Pomerov's mainframe at the refinery and found Tedworth's research, but we were shut out before we could read it. You'll need to get to the server room and access it through the main terminal. I think we can be there. Can you send me directions? I'm marking the location on your phone now. Turned up in a new import this morning. The black one? Yeah. Had it shipped over from France. He asked us to keep an eye on it. Hey, we didn't ask you to run it in. <laughs> no. Well, you'd better make sure nothing happens to me. Good.
You know you really need to get a better car. That piece of junk breaks down on you every other week. It's not that bad. Yes, it is. Remember when you gave me a ride and we spent two and a half hours stranded in the middle of the road? That's what my other... Server room, all quiet. Good. Well, former off is here. Take no chances. Orders are to shoot intruders on site. I lost you. Play again. So you know why we're wasting our time running patrols down here? What? You mean you didn't hear what happened at the casino? No. Someone hit it. Shot the place up. The way I heard it, he was after Pomerov stuff. Some files or something. Ah, great. So now Pomerov spooked and got us all doing patrols. Search isn't here. You'll have to go to the main computer center. It's protected by biometric security measures, though. The only individual with security clearance currently in the building is Pomerov himself. You may be able to get through if you can find Pomerov's fingerprints and a voice sample. fly halfway across the world to drink vodka. Tell me of this new proposal. I want to hear all about it. That's Pomerov's fingerprints. Now you just need to find a clear sample of Pomerov's voice. I'm Stefan Pomerov, President and CEO of Pomerov Industries. That's Pomerov's voice sample. You should be able to access the computer design. center now. Marking location you on your smartphone. In I'm on my way. Are you ready? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Welcome, Mr. Pomerov. Stay alert, man. I want regular control. Something's going on today. We've got to keep the computer center secure. Understood. Copy 8-7. 3-5, you're on break now. 8-7, we'll cover you. 
to be holding for the moment. Good. That means we'll be able to build up to the final level over the next few cycles. As long as a peak you'll let us from the Why? What are you doing with it? They want to try mixing it with the G60. See if they can cope with cross-contamination. Well, it's well, been coming up with you. The research. Yeah, I've got colleagues who work on the They said it was starting to look promising. Well, if they're right, we're going to have to start they taking real the F-29. They said it still has a way to go. Damn it! We thought we could get in without setting off the alarm. We need time to access the files. You've got to keep the phone in range. Do you think you can hold out? You'll be the first to know if I can't. to the main terminal. Seven. Scan the central terminal to access the refinery's network. Bond here. Where are you, 007? Pomerov's refinery. It's worse than we suspected. He's built an entire bioweapons factory. He's churning out toxins by the ton. Can you destroy it? Let me get back to you on that.
take a look at there. The rest of you, come with me. Patrol 26, entering section C. No sign of target. Over. Copy 26. Conduct full search. Target still believed to be in the area. 10 4, conducting search. Anything. Control think he's gonna be coming this way. No. Something good. This control room coordinates the refinery's core systems. Access the central control panel and I'll run a diagnostic. From the looks of things, it seems that if you override the coolant and exhaust systems, you'll be able to trigger a catastrophic chain reaction. Find the override valves, 007. You need to destroy those bioweapons. Seven, the schematics show this route leads to the exhaust override. Lock the valve and cripple the refinery's heat extraction network. We got an ID on this intruder yet? Nothing. safety features.
We must in- way to the coolant station 007 override the system Jesus it's freezing in here oh, you're telling me how long do we have to keep watching over this Suppose as long as... you're heading towards the coolant system. Taking it down will cripple the refinery. Send some support. The squad is down!
like some rupture. Get out of there! the central control panel. This will launch the chain reaction and trigger the meltdown. Nicole? James, where are you? What's taking so long? Meet me outside with the car running as quickly as possible. I'm on my way.
drive. Are you all right? Yeah, I think so. What happened to Pomerol? He ran off. I saw him get on the train that delivers the chemicals to the port. His men were loading them on. Which way? Over there. We've got to stop him before he gets those bioweapons out of the country. Hang on! Are you mad? Like I said, this isn't all fun and games. Look, he's trying to get away. Fasten your seatbelt, we've got a train to catch. Let me see. This should work until we can get you to a doctor. You really did turn out to be my bodyguard. What was that? The train. stopping. We must be at the port. I've got to get off to Pomerov. Here, take this. Stay here. No. Please, take me with you. Can you handle it? Yes. Don't leave me here. Let's go. Start the engines and get us out of here! Now! Set your heading for 220! But there are boats in the way! I don't care what's in the way! Plow through them! There, the hovercraft. When we get on board, do you think you can pilot it? Yes. But you've got to be careful, James. If you puncture one of those chemical johns with a bullet, the bioweapons will escape and kill everyone. I'll keep that in mind. We've picked up Bond's signal. It looks like they're on Pomeroff's tail. 
Acquiring visual now. Bond and Nicole are on an assault hovercraft with what appear to be multiple hostiles on board. Picking up audio now. I'll patch it in. I've got the throttle open all the way, but we're not catching up with him. We're too heavy. I'm heading down to the hold. Maybe we can dump some cargo. All right, Nicole. Try to keep it steady and keep the door locked. We're not alone. OK, will do. Tomrov, you have to get rid of the rest of that cargo.
heading back to the bridge. James, he's firing missiles. He's firing at us. Pomrov's firing at us. Just keep going, Nicole. Hold it steady. I'll take care of them.
Change of plans. Tell me, Captain, are you sure your men can handle this? The safe destruction of all those bioweapons? Bioweapons? What bioweapons? There are no bioweapons in Russia. I see. And those men on the boat, in the hazmat suits. That's the problem with you people in the West. You always think there are WMDs. Then you go to war over it, and then, phew, there are none. You know what kind of paperwork I would have to fill out if there were WMDs here? Clearly, my mistake. Yes. And in the meantime, you can expect my government to be calling your government to register a protest for your actions here. I wouldn't have expected anything less. James, are you all right? I'm better than you. Ah, oh, this? It's given me an entirely new idea for a line of bracelets. Indeed. The cast will be off in a week. It's nothing that a few days at a private beach in Bermuda won't take care of. Care to join me? I've got a plane waiting. I wish I could. But I've still got some mopping up to do here. Hmm, you sure? We might be able to get into all sorts of interesting trouble together. Well, the offer's tempting, but... By the way, what about your friend? Isn't he going to be upset about destroying his car? <laughs> he probably expected it. He already thinks I'm a terrible driver. I wreck everyone I get into. Back in London, they say the same thing about me. Anyway. Congratulations on stopping Pomerov. Thank you. And thank you for helping me facilitate things. You sure I can't convince you to come with me? Positive. Well, I hope I get to see you again. I'm sure our paths will cross. Ciao. Take care. I can't believe you let her go. She wanted you. I need a room. A private room. You should have asked for that while she was still here. Don't you have some cleaning up to do? Some non-existent bioweapons? Second floor of the police station. Third door on your right. And make sure you say hello to MI6 for me. I'll give them your best. Bond here. Yes. I've been waiting to hear from you, 007. Omarov's dead. The factory is destroyed. The remaining bioweapons have been turned over to the Russians. I know. The Prime Minister has already heard from their government. It's threatening to become a diplomatic nightmare. I want you out of there. Back in London for a full debriefing. No. This isn't over. The anonymous tip we received about the bioweapons couldn't have been from the researcher. He was being tortured at the time. Somebody wanted us to get to Pomerov, and the question is who and why. So how do you want to proceed? When I took the courier's cell phone in Istanbul, all the phone calls on it were local except for one that he didn't answer. Have Tanner and Q Branch find that phone. I want to know who the courier was avoiding and why. 